Good day everyone. My name is Shane Sargent and I am a finalist in this year's Humanitarian of the Year competition. As a finalist, I aim to evoke positivity in the youth. I believe that a problem should be addressed at its roots and South Africa's roots is its youth. This video will showcase the lived experiences of victims of bullying. It will also show that there is a positive outcome when being bullied. Let's look at what these people have to say and learn that if one loves themselves, they can overcome bullying. I have personally experienced uh, bullying in quite a number of contexts came to South Africa. By the way, I'm an international student. I'm from the warm heart of Africa called Malawi. Uh, that's my home country. So when I first came to South Africa, uh, it was a new environment altogether. So when I started the, the program, the teaching program, I experienced bullying. I was bullied and my voice was not being heard at all. happens unconsciously so from my observations and also being a victim of bullying not consciously because you know you are unaware that people are insulting you uh, as a form of a joke so growing up I couldn't say the letter um, that Rhino starts with I still can't say it and it plays on my conscious it, it plays on my on my heart because even standing in front of a class people the learners will notice it they'll hear it and then you'll see them giggling so obviously it's up to me to make a change the experiences of bullying that i had have had a significant positive impact of my life uh, on my life in fact i would say at this point i'm here as a postgraduate student mainly because of the bullying that i experienced first at the workplace because after i was uh, faced with all those situation at work then i sat down i had to think like what would be the best way of me escaping this situation so I thought of going back to school and do my metric because I felt like if I can just devote effort on my studies, it would be the best way of me climbing up to the levels where my seniors who were bullying me were. So I went back to do my metric, I worked hard, I dedicated myself. And at the end of the day, I made it to the University of Malawi. And after finishing first year at the University of Malawi, I was awarded a scholarship to come and study in South Africa. But the origin of it all is the bullying that I was facing, so I was looking for a way of escaping it. But then, also, you need to be aware of people's emotions. And me standing in front of a class, I need to stand firm and know that Whatever they say saying behind my back shouldn't get to me because I am me, I am the person that I'm meant to be and this is who I am. Wow guys, I don't know about you but I sure have goosebumps after listening to those stories. Celebrities such as Angelina Jolie, Jessica Alba, Miley Cyrus and Selena Gomez have all admitted to being bullied and they've all dedicated their lives to the fight against no bullying. But guys, I do know that everyone cannot come out as strong as these individuals did and I know that bullying can have detrimental effects on victims. That is why in my next video I will showcase how you can deal with these situations and learn to love yourself. Because guys, if there's one message that I can leave you with, it is to love yourself and to be happy with who you are. And if you are happy, doesn't matter what anyone else thinks. 
Thank you so much for listening.